Anyone who has driven on Silver Bell Road over the past decade will agree that it's like driving on the moon. The crumbling road is heavily used by employees of the GM Orient assembly plant, trucks stopping by the waste management landfill, and shoppers heading to Great Lakes Crossing or the retail stores located along Brown Road. If you've dodged potholes or just flat out avoided Silver Bell, well, there's good news on the horizon. Orion Township has been awarded $7 million by the U.S. House Appropriations Committee to go towards the rehabilitation of 2.6 miles of roads that include Silver Bell, Giddings, and Brown Road. When General Motors announced a $4 billion investment in the GM Orient assembly plant at the beginning of 2022, there was an urgency to improve the infrastructure surrounding the plant. Uh, we went to work um, talking to anybody that would listen to us at MDOT, at the Road Commission, state legislature, at appropriations, the governor's office, the Michigan Economic Development Corporation, and then in, in uh, D.C., our congressional representative, uh, Alyssa Slotkin. So, uh, we kind of took our show on the road, if you will, and pitched the issue. Um, we, we're going to have this beautiful state-of-the-art automotive production facility, one of the most high-tech on planet Earth, and the infrastructure around the facility is garbage. Um, and so we are super excited that um, we were recommended. Uh, Congresswoman Slotkin received 90 community funding project requests from all the different communities that she represented. Uh, she's moving to a different district now um, and of that she got to submit 15 for funding and of the 15 we were one of the 15 we were the only one that was recommended to be fully funded we asked for seven million they're funding us for seven million which is awesome uh, and it was by far the largest i think more than double the next request so i mean most of these requests were a couple hundred thousand ours was seven million so we are excited the $7 million received from the Community Project Funding Program brings the total to over $12 million in funds to repair the roads owned and maintained by Oakland County. Township Supervisor Chris Barnett told us he's seeking additional funding to bring the total closer to $20 million. Barnett added that it's the township and the county who are responsible for maintaining the infrastructure, not the businesses themselves. These improvements are meant to lure businesses to invest in Orion Township. That was part of the incentives that were given to GM to put this $7 billion investment in the state of Michigan. So, you know, some people call it corporate welfare. I call it smart business. I mean, we were competing with other, other states for these thousands and thousands of jobs and billions of dollars in investment. And what we're giving them is the same thing we've, tax breaks we've, we've given to other uh, manufacturers in our community in the decade I've been here. Completely legal, completely above board, um, existing law that existed long before GM announced this investment. So they're getting a tax break for 12 years. Um, and they expect that the community that they're coming to is gonna have the infrastructure required to support them. That's the bottom line. What about waste management? You know, a lot of people point fingers at their trucks uh, utilizing Silver Bell. Where were they? Yeah, so, so waste, we have an interesting arrangement with waste management. That we receive a percentage of the tipping fees. We receive 5% of their tipping fees. So whatever uh, revenue they generate, 5% comes back to the township. It's used for capital improvement. Those are the monies that we use to build Wildwood Amphitheater. Um, some of the facility here was funded through the waste management fee. Um, so we already do receive revenue from them outside of the regular property taxes that they pay. Um, again, I think it's um, not their job to necessarily, their job is to maintain their site, make sure they're following the laws. Um, the roads that lead up to it that they don't own, it's hard to ask a company to invest into something they don't own. The roads are owned by the county. So um, they're great partners as well, and we do generate revenue from them that we use for great community projects, but roads are not one of them. The Road Commission of Oakland County will begin work on the project in 2024. The new roads will have to withstand the weight of 3,000 commercial trucks and 18,000 vehicles per day. Sewers, traffic signals, and crosswalks will be updated, and over 18,000 feet of safety paths will be created. If you have any questions or concerns, feel free to visit orienttownship.org for contact information. In Orient Township, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ONTV News.